Hi, Carl here for Pro-V TV. I'm here at NAB 2019 over at the Aperture booth having a chat to Ted about the new tiny little Aperture RGB light, also their new RGB light bulb and the app that connects them all together. Okay, so Ted, these are very exciting. Yes, what indeed. are these? These are very new. These are the new Emiran MCs. There are secret releases from NAV. A yeah. couple secret releases coming out, so this is the first one off the bat. First off, if you're familiar with the Emiran M9, mm -hmm. basically the MC is going to be the same size as an M9, twice as bright off the bat, so it's about the brightness of an MX, but way smaller. Metal build, aircraft grade aluminum. On top of here, I've got full hue and saturation control, so I got 36,000 different colors that I can actually get out of this single device right here. That is really cool. In addition to having full hue and saturation control, I also have effects. I've got things like paparazzi, fireworks, explosions. All this is now built into your actual device. And these are going to come not only in solo kits, but also in multi kits. And these cases right here, again, we've seen the way that you try to charge your M9s. A million cables out there. Trying to solve that a little bit here. So what this has got here is magnetic slots in here, wireless charging, just plug the case into the wall, and in 75 minutes you go from zero to 100% of battery. Amazing. Is, do you know if that's a normal standard wireless charging? Is it can work all. with a wireless thing? This is your own design? This is actually this PD case. wireless charging, so it's actually quick okay. charge. Uh, okay. Super, super famous out there. Of course, we're using the best technology that's available. Again, cutting edge stuff. We've got television lightning and the ability to control all this stuff wirelessly via app using Bluetooth SIG mesh. Talk about that a little bit later on when we talk about yep. the app, but what that basically means is that all of my lights are going to connect in a network. Mm -hmm. All of my lights are talking to each other. I can group them together and I can control everything from my iOS device or Android device. It means with a little light like this, you can just rig several of them along a ceiling. You oh, could absolutely. turn them into a bigger source. You could do yeah. all sorts of things. With and because it's magnetic in the back, I can literally stick this onto a fridge. I can stick this onto a metal pole. Not a problem. Super easy and quick. Very good point. I mean, I yeah. think RGB technology really works in small little lights like this because yeah. if you think about when you're going to use those those gels. You're yeah. going to use them in the background. You're accent going to use them lights. as a backlight. You're never really washing someone's face with that. It's not exactly. so often. Yeah. Exactly. So perfect little accent lights, especially since we sell them in multi kits. If you want a bunch of up lights, mm -hmm. 12 little up lights, yep. architecture yep. lights. Ah, oh, beautiful. You can yep. literally lay them out. Go to the Taj Mahal, put a bunch of RGB lights, have them all change color together. Beautiful you might need quite here. a few to light up the Taj Mahal. You would need a quite a few. You can buy <laughs> maybe two 12 light packs. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> But uh, the idea, of course, is that they do come in these multi-kits ready to go so you can be creative however you want to use them. And talking of lighting up the background, I noticed you've got a, a little light bulb over yeah. there as well. That's Absolutely. something I wasn't expecting Yes, from you guys. indeed. So I'm going to turn this off the TV so it stops flickering on us. <laughs> going to off mode. Now, the RC over here is basically our new Amaran lights. So basically, what we're trying to do is we're trying to reinvent the smart bulb. Smart bulbs are great. They already exist from the consumer world. Problem, though, a couple things. One, TLCI and CRI color fidelity not so great. Generally speaking, you can see it on the boxes. They'll say like 80 CRI and they're like really proud of it. Filmmakers, <laughs> we, we need something way better than that. Absolutely. So all of our stuff, TLCI and CRI of 95 plus, no problem there. In addition to that, flickering. A lot of those home bulbs, they flicker even at normal frame rates, like 24 or 30 frames per second. So no flickering. I don't care how fast you're shooting. You can shoot it on Phantom, no flickering from our bulbs. In addition to that, we've got a built-in battery into the actual socket, so you can actually unplug it if you want to go into the desert and set up like a lantern by yourself. The entire thing lights on RGB by itself. Yeah. Full RGB control, RGB WW, and in addition to that, I'm missing one more thing. I know I'm going to remember it. RGB flickering, battery built inside, TLCI CRI. Last one is going to be actual app control. So, the problem with a lot of smart bulbs is that you're usually trying to connect to a wireless router. Because yep. again, they're meant for the home, not for filmmaking sets. Yep. Most filmmaking sets, at least a lot of filmmaking sets, especially if you're on location, you're not going to have Wi-Fi. doesn't make sense. It's not going to work. So, using SIG Mesh, you can actually create a network because all of our new lights actually have Bluetooth built in, transmitter and receiver. So all of your lights are going to connect, make a network that you can tap into with your phone. So if and any of the lights dies, can the, the bigger lights exists. be on that network as well as all these smaller ones? In fact, they already are. Okay. The 300D Mark II already has it built in. We're keeping it a secret, of course, up until now. 300D already has that Bluetooth built into it. So okay. these tiny little lights are actually communicating with 300D, which means that I don't have to be near the 300D. I just have to be near the closest light, and that will spread my directions. It will spread my controls anywhere. Yeah. That's very cool. That means I can approximately get 400 meters of distance between me and my lights, I just need an 80 meter step between each light. I can do 65,000 lights on one SIG mesh connection. 
If my phone dies or my Wi-Fi connection dies, doesn't matter. All the lights are creating their own network that I can just log into a new phone and tap into it. Yeah. That is amazing. So what, what control does that app give you? Um, yeah. It gives you, obviously, the actual controls, the brightness and everything like that. Yep. Is there anything else? So you get control, you get color temperature. And what's cool about it is that it's a smart app. So it's actually going to communicate with your light. And because love is a two-way street, your light will actually tell your controls, hey, I'm an RGB light. These are my menus. Hey, I'm a bicolor light. Here are my menus. I don't have the ability to do what the RGB light does, so we're not going to show that. The app intuitively will adapt to whatever light you're plugging it in. And if you've got old aperture lights, like the 672, the 120D Mark ones, we're actually coming out with a thing called the Citus Link Bridge, which means that we're actually going to be adding Wi-Fi capability to all of the aperture lights in the ecosystem. So your 120Ds, app powerful. 120Ds, you're going to be able to do things like fireworks, explosions on your 672s, even if you bought them like six years ago. That's amazing. How's that going to connect? Yeah. So the Sidus Link is basically a plug-in little AV connection, little electronic dongle. It'll stay on set and it'll convert your app to RF frequency so you can control those lights. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah. I mean, that is really cool. Do you know well, about you. pricing? Pricing. So for the MCs, we're looking at approximately $79 per piece. Super affordable. We're excited about it. They're going to come in full kits as well for about eleven to $1,200 for a 12 light kit. Okay. Uh, the RC is going to be priced at approximately $59. You can buy them as a single, a double, or a quad. And then finally, the app, free for all. Yep. Everyone can get the app for free. It doesn't matter, Android, iOS, iPad. If you want the Citus Link, the actual adapter, trying to keep it as affordable as we can. We're going to try to keep it under 100 USD. Okay, that's absolutely awesome. Thank you so absolutely. much, Tim. Thanks for tuning in. Appreciate seeing you guys.